uh, for my 60. Okay, let's. <laughs> okay, I'm trying this. I'm trying this. I'm trying this. Um, uh, we'll see how it works. My first try at this. Oh, why? I, I keep on saying I try this. All right, stop it. All right. This week, uh, we are going to continue probably our last coin that is going to be involved in the um, Silver Squeeze Challenge. So, as you can see, we have slabs, slabs. Love slabs, slabs, love slabs, love slabs. Um, this one was one of the old era coins that I did. I don't, I'm not really into era coins, but this is one of the old era coins I have. Um, this from Mississippi Metals, uh, really, really special Mississippi. Thank you so much for sending that in to me. Um, and then we have uh, this beauty for the Silver Challenge. It is, okay, do it, can I do it? Uh, right about there. All right, so. I'm trying this because, yes, I get things about, you know, my hands move, this, that, and the other thing. So this is the 1923S Slabbed Peace Dollar. Oh, oh remember, remember this list here? Um, made in San Francisco. It's probably going to be my last um, Slabbed Peace Dollar acquisition this year because, well, you know what, what went on with... Um, the acquisition so all my money seems to be uh, tied up in that uh, but I did get this before that transaction the uh, minage is the highest uh, minage that they made of uh, peace dollars in San Francisco 19 million zero two zero 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 composition is with all the peace dollars 90% silver and 10% copper it's gonna work Gonna work? Is it gonna work? Well, I gotta. Okay, so I gotta squeeze it down a little bit, change angle, that kind of thing. Um, oops. But there it is. Um, all the notes I noticed that I found on this is saying that it was a poor strike year. Eventually, they put the molds uh, too far away from the stamp, and it just bink instead of bink. So that's what happened. That that they're saying happened in San Francisco under two. Um, oh, jeez. Uh, 1923. Um, there are not a lot of coins in bad condition and in okay and a U. Most of the can, coins are in mint state 63 and, and worse grades. Uh, significantly drops off to when you hit mint state 64 and, and above. All those coins significantly, their amounts drop off. Um, the auction record for this 1923S. Okay. Is that better? Okay. Well, you, you, know, you have to tell, tell me in the notes whether you like this better. I still got to kind of figure it out, but you get a better shot of the coin itself. Uh, it was $49,200 coin in Mint State 66 in 2021. Um, in the range that uh, I keep on coming back to, that's Mint State 64. The range was anywhere from four hundred fifty-six dollars up to a thousand eighty. With a thousand eighty, that's it's a one-off. Most of them were in the um, at the upper range, were in the six hundred dollar range. So between four and six hundred dollars is the range that they came in. Uh, this is, as I said, this is one of the last ones that I have left to complete the collection with. Let me get it out. Let me. Yeah, you know, I, I like holding these guys right so there it is uh let me put it there whoops and it slides all over the place and look at this wow thrilled oh look at that one two three four four to go four to go and we'll be done um and we're gonna put it in i had to bring this home um, but I'll be going heading back to the bank in a day. Get it back in the vault. And we'll go right in there. Isn't that great? All right. And as we say, another one down. Four left. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Catch my breath. Uh, as we say, as dancers, collectibles, um, coins. Well, well, let's see how this works here. Oh, yeah. See, there's coins there. Coins. Uh, up here is 69 DCAM. Deep cameo. Slab. Oh, where the hell did I put it? Oh, I got it. I got it. Everything's fine. 
Slammed coins. Yeah, I got to put one of those plastic things on it. And coins. Only a few more left. Come on, we can do it. We can do it. We can do it.